All right. Hi, everybody. My name is Dee Corchin. I am thrilled that you uh, made time in your evening to be on Team Time tonight, which is uh, Monday, April 8th. And we took a little break from our normal scheduled trainings, um, the, the sequence we've been following, because we really wanted to pause and make sure that everybody um, was aware of and could participate in and have the opportunity to ask questions with a new challenge that we are going to be offering. So give me a little show of hands or maybe write, actually do it better in the comments. Like if you have participated in, either as a client or as a coach, one of our prior challenges that we've done, um, just maybe put that in the comments below so we can kind of get a feel for um, what our audience is and who has participated before in the challenges. So use the chat feature. We've done, uh, the, I think the last one we did was like a Get Lean in 2019 was uh, the one that we rolled out in January. So Meg's saying she loves challenges, great opportunity to connect with people. Carol, that's how she started. Um, let me just try to meet this person. All right. And um, so what we're doing, and that's why I knew we'd have an audience, we've been adding so many new coaches that we don't want to make any assumptions that anybody knows what these are um, so that everybody can fully participate. So what is a challenge? This is going to be um, what we call our summer slim down challenge. So we know that summer is right around the corner uh, with Memorial Day, just, um, you know, what, seven or eight weeks from now. And, um, and then 4th of July, just like less than three months from now. So our mission is we want to be out there and start talking to people and sharing with them and starting to stir up the possibility of what if this could be their best summer ever. And when we mean it, when we say that, we don't necessarily just mean in how they physically look, um, but we know they're physically going to look great. But we want people to walk out and experience summer um, and activities like going to the pool, going to barbecues, being with family, going to the beach where people feel confident and secure in their own skin, that they feel healthy um, so that they can show up and be fully present. And I don't know about you, but there's been times in my life um, when I don't physically feel good about the way I look, and it just affects how we, how we show up. So we love to offer something like a challenge. It just gives us a reason to reach out to people um, and start to market um, something. So let me kind of give you the framework, and then we'll talk some details on it. So this is going to be called the Summer Slim Down Challenge. And it's going to run with starting with a start date of Monday, April 22nd. So start, feel free to take notes, but I'll also be uh, uh, right after this call, be uh, putting out a document with coach procedures for you with all of this. So, um, and we decided to make it fun and to bring us right up into Memorial Day. I love Meg. She's got her hands in the air for fun. Um, that we're going to make it a five week challenge. So that's going to take people, they're going to start the day after Easter. We debated over that, but we decided let's start the day after Easter. Um, and then five full weeks, we'll bring people exactly to Monday, Memorial Day. We'll actually finish up on the Sunday before. So what perfect timing. And the goal is that we are really, we're not looking for one month clients or people to reactivate for one month. What we're really hoping is that this awakens somebody to what is possible and that sometimes people who are a little nervous or a little bit scared can say to themselves, well, you know what? I could commit to five weeks, right? So we want to roll this out right away because, you know, as your leaders, we really try to collaborate to help you with ideas because I think most of us on this call, put a yes in the comments, if in the, in the chat if you'd like, but um, most of us would like to help more people. Yeah, I mean, I know that that is my mission. My heart is to help as many clients as a team as we can, as well as coaches um, and people that want to join our mission. And we know that very often that starts with people becoming clients first. So yay for all the yeses showing up there. So what a challenge does is that this gives us the opportunity to start connecting with people, that we can um, do Facebook posts, we can personally invite, uh, we can use, have follow-ups with people that we can personally invite and say, hey, we've got something special and we can build momentum and do they wanna be a part of it? And so what that would look like is, um, uh, Danny, do you wanna go ahead and ask a question before I go further? Nope, accidental hand raise? Okay, all right, cool. Um, that um, 
what we're going to do is we're going to have first step one will be we're going to create a Facebook event. In fact, it's already created. I'm going to post it right after this. Um, and a Facebook event is going to give all the details for it. Um, and it's something that's easy for you to share on social media. So the first thing that's going to happen is after this call, I will I'll put this Facebook event in our coach group. And what you'll want to do is you're going to want to go ahead and uh, indicate that you're going to go or attend the Facebook event. And this whole challenge takes place online and it takes place in our normal Facebook Eat, Live, and Be Opt to Be a group. And you'll get questions from people like, do I have to show up? Do I have to be somewhere? Um, and because the Facebook event makes us give a time, like it'll say it's starting at 7 a.m. on April 22nd, all that means so that you can be able to explain this to people is all that means is that um, starting on April 22nd, um, that there'll be a Facebook post every day, day there for them. And so what we're looking to do is actually start marketing now. And I'll give you some tips on how to do that. But um, what we're looking to do is, is actually acquire new clients for you. So if somebody, you're going to share this Facebook event. And when you start getting people that you've shared it with, indicating that they are interested or that they would um, like to go to it, that is your cue to reach out to them and have a conversation or people might start private messaging you what is this and all you're doing at that point is bringing them to a call with a normal health assessment call and what we're doing with the challenge is the way that we promote it and why they work so well is that we are um, gathering a group of people that are going to all start on the same day they're linking arms and they're going to run with momentum together. And there's just power and people knowing that they are a part of something um, that, that increases their own accountability and enthusiasm and action um, and being a part of it. And then, oh, I love it, Mary Lauren, she needs it for herself. I encourage us as coaches um, to be a part of this as well, because we know that when our health is in line and when we're um, moving towards what we want with our goals, that that naturally um, just radiates from us and helps us with being more integrity with our business. Um, but I want to just pause for a second, see if there's any questions or Meg, if you had anything you want to just go ahead and jump in and share because you've been involved in a lot of these. Yeah, I love these. They're a great way to um, get old clients re-engaged that maybe haven't hit their goal yet. It's a great way to be out there and talk on Facebook, get people excited. You may have you know, a bunch of new referrals that you might get because of this group. Shut, put your hand up. My kids, this is a family affair. They're excited about tonight's team call. Uh, but anyways, so highly recommend to leverage your clients, leverage um, the people that you know, um, and set a goal. Like maybe your goal is you want to you wanna start five new clients through this challenge. Maybe it's 10. Would you think about what goal you might be, that you might have and put it in the comments below as far as how many people you would like to help? Um, I think that could be really cool, but I want to let you know this group is going to be a little bit different because um, we are going to have some cash prizes that people can win for having the greatest percentage of pounds lost each for each of the weeks. Now, one question you will get is, does this cost anything? No, this is free for your clients, but um, we are going to help um, try to give some extrinsic motivation by giving them a cash prize for each weekly winner. And then there will be a grand prize for whoever loses the most over the five week period up to Labor Day. So we're going to do that by percentage of pounds lost. So we will have, and Dee will probably talk about this in a minute, but we're going to have a Google document or a spreadsheet for them to go in and um, confidentially put their name, their email, who their coach is, and what their starting weight is and their weight each week. So we can calculate the winners. Um, this will not be posted anywhere. It will not be shared anywhere. Um, we know that this information is, is private and really special. So, But this is the way that we can try to figure out the fairest way to give um, the prizes to the right people. So really excited about this. We've never done this before, but um, it's just fun. It's, we feel like, you know, it's kind of like being Oprah. Everybody, we have, you know, it's kind of <laughs> makes things a little bit extra fun. So um, I'm excited. Absolutely. Yeah. It's like, you're a winner. I'm a winner. Uh, I am loving your enthusiasm. Um, guys, I'm seeing your goals that you are interested in. And um, Frank, yes, this is open. Who, who is this open to? Let's go over that for a minute. 
one requirement is that somebody does need to be a client of Optivia. All right, so if they want to participate, they do need to be a client of Optivia. And what we tell the individuals when they ask about it is that we know we can give predictable results. We know that if they join this challenge and they engage in the community, the education, the eating plan, that they will get those results that they are looking for. Um, now, we have to be careful with our um, compliance guidelines and things like that in terms of what we say, but I think an off-the-record conversation with somebody is you could say, you know what, you could probably anticipate that you would lose about 10 pounds, you know, in those five weeks. So that's a great way for somebody to really start to make impact and uh, make, a, make a dent in their, in their health goals and immediately start feeling better. So we're going to work it to, um, number one, market it to acquire new clients. So how do you do that? Um, that's a number of different ways. The Facebook invite and any social media publications that you do, whether you do it on Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, whatever you choose, um, remember that that is a marketing layer. What you're doing with that is that, that I put that in the category of marketing. So it's good, it's visibility, it's promotion, it might generate some interest, but really the best way Two, um, to do this is to personally invite individuals. So you do the big mass, right, on social media. That's kind of you're putting it out there to see who might come to you. But your, your uh, actual uh, results in achieving your goal of five or 10 or 12 new clients that I've been seeing, that is going to happen when you take um, the time to personally call somebody. Maybe somebody who's been on your heart, somebody you've been thinking about, somebody who's on your list. Um, and most importantly, we all have that list of people that we've been following up with. You know, all those people that weren't ready the first time that we talked to them. I love a challenge because it gives me a reason to call. You know, it'd be like if I was calling Lynn, I would be like, hey, Lynn, you know, I just wanted to touch base with you. I know we talked about your health. How are you doing? Because number one, right, we want to see we're, we're carrying individuals. We want to see how we're doing. They're doing, well, hey, I, I don't know where you are right now, but I really just thought you'd probably want to be aware of something super fun that we're doing. Um, and then it gives you the opportunity to lead into and share a little bit about the challenge. Um, and so that has like a start date. It, it provides a sense of urgency. You know, um, so what, like, again, this is really just, it's marketing and it's connecting with people and inviting for them to begin their journey with Optivia with a specific time frame. And then um, the other way that you could do, you can, um, you can call people, you can private message them, you can text them. Um, what have I missed, Meg? Is there anything around that? And then Frank asked the question, um, Beth, I'll come right to you, Beth. Um, they, um, Frank asked the question, could current clients participate? And the answer is absolutely. We'll put this Facebook um, event in, our, in there too, um, because we know that sometimes our clients get a little wobbly. You know, they might have started, they might have gotten a little shaky on their journey. So this gives them a reason to uh, refocus. And also, mm -hmm. I love this opportunity to reach back out to all of my inactive clients. So people maybe that have reached their goal, they've been gone for a couple of years, or maybe they just kind of slipped away. They just weren't ready to fully see it out um, you know, in the past. It gives a great opportunity for you to reach to all of those inactive and former clients as well. Beth Bilton, did you have a question? No, I was just going to say another thing that I've done in the past is actually printed the flyer and mailed it to people. So they actually get things, something in the mail. Um, and then follow up with them later. If they're not on Facebook or they don't see it, so I just, I mail it to people that I really want them to maybe join us and then follow up with a phone call. That's great. So there's that intentional invite, right? So, she, you know, nobody gets anything in the mail anymore, right? It's so rare. So that's a really, really good idea to do that. Maybe jot a little handwritten note, thought, I, thought you might be, I'm sure you do that, thought you might be in, interested in this. And I love, the most important thing Beth just said there was that she follows up with a phone call. And that is definitely what we want to always be doing is inviting and following up with individuals. Um, Carol, um, Quintera, did you have a question? I think before you were raising your hand. Oh, let's unmute you. There you are. Oh, you're okay. Good. You got your question answered. Okay. Have I missed any 
buddy. Anybody have their, um, we've got a couple of pages of participants. Anybody, if you have a specific question at this point, go ahead and unmute. All right. Well, speaking of, um, you know, Beth said she invited via a flyer. Um, Carol Telesello, you want to come on just for a few minutes? I want you guys to see what could be possible with somebody that you invite to this challenge and when they join you. Carol, you want to share your story? Sure. Yeah. Um, I didn't know anything about Optavia. Um, I'm sure it had been talked about in the office, but I had not ever heard about it. But all of a sudden, uh, I was just really, really, really down and had uh, hit rock bottom, actually, and was not even thinking about any kind of program or losing weight because I've tried everything and nothing had ever worked. Uh, but I was going into our break room <laughs> to get a Diet Coke, actually, and on the table was a flyer. And I said, what is this? And it was just talking about a challenge that was coming up. And uh, the fact that, you know, you lose weight and doing it with a group of people and community and uh, give, it was a 30 day trial. And I thought, well, I, and it was, Larry had put it out, Dee's husband. And, um, and so I saw the name on there and I just, I gave Dee a call. I said, so for me, it was one last shot. Uh, I can give it a 30-day trial and let's see. I really didn't think it would work, to be honest, because uh, nothing ever had. But um, I wanted to try. And I love the idea of a time frame that you could try it. If it didn't work out, no strings attached. Um, and yet community and doing it with other people, too, at the same time. So it was awesome. Oops. So your four week challenge and thank you um, to Larry and I'll let Larry talk in a second about spouse support and how they can help you spread the word. Um, but your four week challenge turned into what and how much weight did you lose? <laughs> I started it uh, the end of September of 2017 and I've lost 65 pounds and uh, <laughs> and then I am a also a regional director. So uh, it's ended up life changing, life changing. Completely, completely. And, and it's totally changed my family, uh, my sister Pat and husband and niece and the list goes on. There's quite a bit of family that has come on because of it, because of that. that that's really humbling. That's also kind of scary to me. If I had not stopped to read the flyer uh -huh. and then if I didn't go ahead and take a chance what that one decision, what could be different. Right, right. And, and you know, and that's with me sharing with Larry and he was like helping me come up with ideas with how to spread the word, you know? Um, so congratulations. So I hope everybody picked up on that. So not only did Carol completely transform her life, she was um, discouraged, not even sure she wanted to venture into something else, but said she could do it for four weeks, right? Where ours is five weeks, this new challenge, but she took the chance. Um, not only did that, that it did exactly what we wanted, where she got momentum, she started feeling good, she stayed with it. Um, she became a coach. And then not only is she helping clients, right? So she's a regional director. So she has her own executive director business and has also developed an executive director on her team, which happens to be her sister and had a ripple effect into her family of all the people that have been helped there. So that is the true Optavia story. And that is exactly what we are about. So thank you, Carol. And when you guys are marketing like this and sharing, just think about that. You could be completely transforming somebody's life. Um, so Larry, you want to just take a second to talk about, you know, um, spouses and friends and how they can help us uh, family to spread the word. Sure. Absolutely. And Carol, thanks for sharing. That was, uh, you know, it's one of those things you kind of, you don't know the impact you're going to have until, you know, something amazing like what you've experienced happens. And it, it just, it, it's exciting. I see a lot of faces here on the screen and I'm just so thankful that I, I can be a part of that. And I did that only by sharing because again, I, I still have a full-time job. I do this part-time helping with D, but you know, one of my goals was to get the word out and just continue to, to share the benefits of Optavia and how it can help people and really um, help them you know, get their lives back and get them to really uh, 
see what's what the potential is. So, you know, as far as sharing, I mean, one of the things, this is a great opportunity for your, your, your family, your spouses, your friends, your neighbors, folks that support you to kind of get the information out there, share it uh, on social media, uh, take a hard flyer, take a hard copy flyer, put it out in a break room where people can see it in, in a clubhouse, in a neighborhood, up, uh, up near your tennis courts. You know, it's a great way to help their tennis game, right? So um, there's a lot of different ideas to get out there and ask people to just support you in what you're trying to do. And, and again, there, our big goal, get America healthy. So um, just get creative with it, get fun with it. Um, if you're taking your walk in your neighborhood, I, I, you know, if you want to drop flyers in your mailbox or uh, for people that are on your heart, um, by all means do it because you don't know where it's going to hit. And my hope is that they can hit on somebody and, and they're, they're going to be on our, on our calls and hopefully a coach someday and the ripple effect just continues. And that's, that's the cool thing. I saw somebody said it gives goosebumps. I mean, just think about it. There's somebody out there hurting today and we're going to reach them and we're going to change their life and they're going to be friends with us and we're going to see them at convention and we're just going to have a great relationship and a great partnership. So that kind of stuff is, is, is what this is all about. So enough, I'm done. So exactly right. Never about just getting clients, right? Like we are truly in the life transformation business. And what I love about the challenge, and I'm going to try to hit on a couple of the questions um, that, um, that was there, was that um, we're going to fully integrate these individuals, even if it's our existing clients who are in e Optavia, they can just join in. They're already in um, as their coach. I would in your weekly calls this week and next week be telling your clients about this coming um, and ask them if they want to participate. Number one, we're going to get that another level of engagement for them. And secondly, do they have anybody that might want to do it with them? Right. So there you can increase referrals. We can that actually opens the door to possibly having coaching conversations with your clients. Right. So if they have referrals, we can talk to them, talk to them about exploring coaching. Um, but your current clients who are so happy can actually help us spread the word as well. And what we do with the challenge is we immediately integrate. Right. We know the word integrate means to make whole to complete. So we want to uh, bring people in, right? So they have the attraction of coming in um, and they know that they're gonna lose weight. They're probably aware that they're gonna be doing an eating plan, but every single day, there will be a daily post for them. It comes in at 7 a.m. It'll only take them like five or 10 minutes is what I tell individuals, but it's gonna be an interactive post. And you're gonna be blown away when you see all the responses and everything that put it, but we'll be asking people to state their goals. We'll be asking, we'll be doing water challenges. We'll be uh, hitting on all the habits of health um, and asking for that interaction with them. Uh, we will be uh, inviting them and encouraging them and possibly rewarding them for attending the habits of health call, right? We talked about a weekly cash, you know, weekly prize of some sort that might be cash or a gift card or a wellness credit. Um, so that, you know, we're going to give it for these things that we know are going to integrate them into our full system that's going to make them just want to become long-term Optavia clients. So again, I will be posting um, coach procedures. I will be posting the Facebook event Right after this, I will be sharing an image that you can use for your own Facebook um, uh, post. But I have a request. I put it in there um, in the comments. I, I could use somebody's help. If anybody with our group, we've got such talented people here. If anybody is great with um, flyer creation, uh, back when we did it with Carol, we were using an outside vendor to help us, um, and it was an online program, and they did automatic flyer creation for us. Um, and that's, you know, I, there's a lot of things I'm just willing to admit I'm not that great at, and that would be one of them. So if anybody is skilled in that area and can connect with me right after this uh, meeting, we'll get you a flyer ASAP for that. Um, and you don't have to be an expert if you're just somewhat good at <laughs> one of those programs would be, would be great. Um, so questions before we finish out, I want Meg to uh, share a little bit and to share about um, something else super exciting we have going on for our team. Feel free to unmute yourself. And this is for questions right now, right, Dean? Questions right now, general questions about the challenge. 
and we will uh, post all this. Feel free to ask your questions in the group. Uh, things that are working for you, post them in our Facebook group. I mean, we uh, this is Coaches Op for Change. We really want that to be an interactive page where we're collaborating and sharing ideas and things that are going well, um, just so we can really, really help and support each other. All right, good stuff. Are you guys excited about this? It's a huge, huge, huge opportunity. So again, I hope you participate. I hope you share often on social media. And remember, those personal invites are going to make the biggest difference in those conversations you have with your clients um, this week and next before it begins. Um, you would want to be promoting pretty quickly because if we think about it, uh, we would want to, if somebody's going to be a new client, we're going to want to place their order, right? We're going to want to place their order so they have everything to start before Easter. Um, we've got Good Friday in there as well. They're going to start the Monday after. Um, it's okay if they start a day or two after. We're not going to be sticklers for that. But if you think about it, we've got about a week and a half that we would really want to be promoting in order to, to get orders in for your new clients. And uh, we got some good steep goals out there. All right, Meg Johnson, you want to share a little bit about part two of what we're doing for our team to help grow? Yes. We are so excited and um, just kind of amazed. There's like so much going on. Um, so thank everybody that for being on tonight's call, for getting people healthy with this challenge. So tomorrow night, you probably got the email. We are launching our Massive Momentum Boot Camp, um, which we are really excited about. People ask questions all the time, like what's the how? How do we, how do we get into action? How do we build a business? What, what kind of so that boot camp is going to be like put your bootstraps on and jump into the deep end with us. We are so excited about um, just helping everybody get into action. And um, so it's going to be tomorrow night. It's going to be um, 8 to 9 p.m. Eastern, 7 to 8 Central. And um, there is a private Facebook group. So if you are going to be a part of that, you will want to open your email if you already applied. There is a link to join our private Facebook group in your email box. You do not want to miss that private Facebook group. That is where so much of the meat and the goodies are going to be um, between our sessions. So Dee and I have been just brainstorming and planning and really excited for what this is going to mean for you and your business, especially as we get ready for convention and seeing what um, what's going to happen between now and convention going to be pretty exciting. Oops. And thank you, Meg. Yes. Yeah. Um, yeah. So super excited about this. You know, we, we, you know, Meg and I were like, what can we do for our team? What can we do those that really want to stretch and grow and maybe at a pace faster than they have been? So uh, we've been collaborating. And then when we started sharing about it, we were blown away. So um, if that feels like something that you are ready for, we would welcome you. If you're like, no, I'm good. I like the way things are. Our Monday night calls are here every Monday for you. They're not going anywhere. Um, so this will be done separate. And, um, and like I said, check your e uh, email box for that uh, for more details. And that will be tomorrow at 8 p.m. And to answer the question, the calls would be um, would recorded. And yeah, so, um, so very good, you guys. I always like to respect Dr. Anderson. Dr. A's coach call is up next. It's Mondays at 8. Highly encourage you to hop over there. The link is in the original post that you get for this call. And um, thank you so much. And uh, let's have fun, guys. Let's help a lot of people get healthy. Thanks. We'll see you next time.